Food for plant B and red meats, fresh chilled or frozen 2.5 billion, other vegetable oils 1.8 billion, processed food and vegetables 1.6 billion, and fresh vegetables 1.6 billion. This is going down in four days. It's going to be just about grinding to a halt. Talk about a dark, dark winter and talk about this country being in extreme trouble. And it's also. On the 15th of January, 31,000 truckers will have to have gone along with the deal, you know, to do business or go to the movies or whatever. 31,000 cross that border back and forth. And it's expected that most of them are not going to do it. And so this is going to come to a grinding halt in four days. What's going to happen? Shortages. inflation if you can find it and if you're not prepared you're going to be in, a, in with a group of people they're not having to um, really go through stressful situations to feed the family so i'm going to detail here you can you get the idea and you may not want to be part of that tsunami of chaos but that's what's coming And our friends down under have already had these measures implemented. This picture was sent yesterday. This is up from January the 10th from Coles, the Department of Coal Food Store there. And since they implemented these measures, this is what it looks like. Not very good. And there's already some, a lot of businesses are being shut down because a lot of employees are 